Five years ago in 2010, Crossroads embarked on uh, Game Change. It was a campaign just like I'm in to go after this aggressive dream of changing the game on a number of initiatives throughout the city. And attacking poverty through CityLink was one of them. And so it was this great dream and this great vision. You know what? We're sitting in it here right now. It's actually happening. Before I became homeless, I started drinking, popping pills, and at this point in time, I was sitting on my couch. I had a shotgun and I put it in my mouth. I pulled the trigger, it didn't go off. I didn't understand, so I went and uh, made sure it was loaded correctly. And it was. And um, that's when I knew God was real. So I went and I went to cock it again. And it was like three in the morning and my son came kicking the door in. And he was screaming and hollering, and he said, hey, what are you doing? You know, why are you doing this? And I knew at that point, I can't end it like this. I gotta carry on. So I did. So I started coming here as a client. And when I got to orientation, I was sitting there, and it's like you felt the presence of God. Every time you walked in here, it's like they were greeting you with love and compassion. Not only did they begin to help me get a job, they taught me how to interview. They taught me how to present myself, posture, and what people look for, words and everything. They taught me how to budget and even save for a car. And they also help you with getting back and forth for, you know, as far as bus tokens and everything. Then they sent me over to Changing Gears. They said, we think you're ready now because they seen I was stable on my job, going to work every day. I went from depression, to feeling okay, to happy, to having joy and peace. I went from homeless, carless, to having a beautiful home, a beautiful car, and a better, awesome job that I love. What I really, truly hope for is that God will be done through me. I hope that He let my story get out there, my life, everything that I've been through my whole entire life, so it can help set women free. We want to invest in social enterprise where we can not only employ more people, because that's really the linchpin to helping people change their lives, but also in addition to employing them with the profit that our social enterprises can make, we can take that profit and plow that back into the mission of, of CityLink and we can further the work that we're doing. You know what, people in Africa are the same as people in Cincinnati. They're parents who want a better life for their kids. They're people who want a job and want a better life. And the common barrier that people in Cincinnati and in South Africa are experiencing is poverty. It's living in this despair of hopelessness where people for your whole life have told you, you're not gonna amount to anything. You are no good. The solution that we have found through CityLink in Cincinnati can really be applied to this hopelessness that South Africans feel as well. So over the last five years, we've been building a relationship with an incredible church in South Africa, a church that we believe is most like us in that country, Grace Bible Church. They're our size, they have over 20 sites, they have an aggressive view towards growth. They want to not only reach people for Christ and help introduce them to a relationship with Jesus, but also flip their city and flip their country. And I'm thrilled to announce that it's happening. It's happening. We have inked a deal with Grace Bible Church where Crossroads and Grace Bible will go in halvesies to help launch a center like CityLink in Soweto, South Africa. With the, the CityLink project that will be coming here to Soweto, we think it's going to be very helpful because, you know, we have a major challenge with people um, we have a lot of unemployment in South Africa. And we think people can be trained to be entrepreneurs. People can be assisted in those kinds of programs. The discussions have gone very well in that we feel it's going to be a true partnership in that Grace brings something to the table, Crossroads brings something to the table, and together we work for a common purpose. And that for us is, is very, very exciting. Working in South Africa is hard. 
but we've stuck with it. We've been hitting the same nail, and that's what's allowed us to build this amazing relationship with the biggest game-changing church and change agent in the entire country, Grace Bible Church. That is because we are tireless workers. We will continue to hit the same nail, and that is what is setting us up for success, that in partnership with Grace Bible, we can see this country changed.